Hi guys and girls, hello and welcome. This is Chaotic here. We're looking at Games with Gold for October 2017. Can they keep up with Sony's offerings for October? Let's go and find out. And first up on the Xbox One, it's available from October the 1st, is a game called Gone Home. It's a conceptual simulation game, somewhat themed after classic adventure titles where how you interact with Space Ranger character determines how far you progress in the game. The title is all about exploring a modern residential locale and discovering the story of what happened there by investigating a deeply interactive game world. The development team aims to push for true stimulation, both in the sense of the physics system but also in allowing the player to open any door or drawer they'd logically be able to and examine what's inside down to small detail. So that's called Gone Home. And your second game on the Xbox One is available from October the 16th. It's called The True In Test. The True In Test is a puzzle video game with gameplay experience from a first person's perspective. The player assumes the role of Ava Truin, an international space agency engineer working at a research station located on Europa, one of Jupiter's moons. The puzzles involve distributing power through a special tool that can collect and fire power spheres into special receptacles to unlock doors or activate other machinery in the game. As the player progresses, additional elements are introduced including the ability to observe scenes and activate certain objects via the station's monitoring cameras and control mobile robots that can be used to explore levels. So that's called the Turing Test, October the 16th. And our first backwards compatible game is called Rayman 3 HD. It's available from October the 1st. Rayman's universe has fallen into a chaotic world of wicked powers, bizarre characters and merciless combat. When Globox accidentally swallows the Lord of the Dark Looms, a fanatic army of trigger-happy hoodlums wreaks ha total havoc to get their Lord back. Rayman's only chance is to purge the Dark Loom Lord from a manic Globox, scale the lands for new powers and battle with hordes of hoodlum soldiers. Even without arms or legs, Rayman can still unleash an arsenal of special powers and fighting moves. That's Rayman 3 HD. And our fourth and final backwards compatible game is called Medal of Honor Airborne. Possibly, quite possibly have heard of the game. A um, little bit about the game. It's a World War II first person shooter game. It's the 11th installment of the Medal of Honor series. A uh, single player mode, you can drop in on a parachute and land where you want and attack each different area from different landing points. There's also a multiplayer mode available where you can fight for the Allies parachuting down to the battlefield or fighting for the Axes and starting on the ground defending the position from enemy paratroopers. So that's Medal of Honor Airborne available from October the 16th. So there we have it guys, there's October's Games of Gold all wrapped up. My thoughts on the offerings, pretty good. We've seen better months in the last few months from Microsoft. It's pretty solid, I give it a 6.5 or 7 out of 10. Certainly hope to have a little bit better next month, maybe some better AA games, but time will tell. We've got Christmas coming up soon, so you may have some good presents. So I hope you've enjoyed the video, guys. Hope we've given you a good idea of what to expect in October. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you have enjoyed. Peace out, guys. See you on the next video.